Well, listen, it's been a tremendous tournament. We've uh, you know, had uh, world-class players from lots of different countries competing, and uh, uh, they're actually showing uh, form that was probably a little bit better than I predicted. I, I thought the scores would be a little bit higher than what's going on at the moment. Well, uh, listen, we have our own golf club at Hills, uh, but uh, we wanted a world-class uh, tournament. Uh, we, we, we wanted a world-class venue, and uh, there's no better place uh, anywhere in Queensland than Brookwater. And, uh, and put the idea to them and uh, they embraced it. And you know, really, not only did Brookwater embrace it, but Ipswich City Council, Mayor Pasali, you know, really got behind uh, promoting junior golf and, and uh, helping, um, I guess, uh, uh, the ties between all the different countries and uh, you know, coming and using this venue. It's just a, a, a fantastic venue. It's a very, very difficult golf course and uh, it really asks a lot of questions of all the players' games. Uh, the golf course itself speaks for itself, you know, the, the quality of the staff and everything that are, that are here are just first class and so we, we know that over the next few years it's just going to grow into a fantastic event. Well, it's been good actually, um, being quite surprised at how well the, the kids have actually handled uh, such a difficult and challenging course um, and um, just watching them go out there and, and have a hit is just inspirational, like to see these kids actually just smash it off the tee and, and just the quality of the shots that they play is uh, yeah very surprising and um, quite encouraging actually. Uh, we're actually very proud uh, to actually hold the you know, ranking of number one in, in Queensland and um, to top it all off to, to be able to host uh, the Queensland Open uh, which hasn't been held for six years to resurrect that uh, tournament is actually um, we're, we're actually quite proud uh, to be the host venue for it. Well, the Hills Golf Academy, it's, uh, uh, it's quite unique. Uh, we're a, uh, a, a golf school. We're, a, uh, we're actually a school, a uh, high school, really from, from prep to year 12. But our main uh, focus in the Golf Academy is uh, that uh, uh, you know, the, the kids come over here that are you know, from overseas and from Australia, and they're, uh, they have career-minded, uh, uh, you know, golf career-minded type people that, uh, that are trying to become really good players. And so... We're quite successful at uh, you know, getting these players to, to either become professional players or go on to uh, college scholarships, those sort of things uh, in the US. And uh, I guess our big two that have already come through the school, uh, Jason Day is a world uh, top 20 player uh, in the men, but Yani Singh, who's the world number one lady player, she's uh, come to Hills uh, for several years as well. Um, uh, during her summer vacations and things like that. So we've had a, a fairly good hand in helping uh, those sort of players uh, become you know, world-class players and leading players. And there are a lot of other uh, players that are following in their footsteps and trying to become uh, high-quality players themselves.